Well, hi everybody. This is Steve Hansen, co-founder of the Janitorial Store in my house cleaning biz. I have a question for you, and I think this is primarily for the residential uh, cleaners out there. But uh, have you ever noticed when you're uh, mopping floors in a residential home, it doesn't matter if it's vinyl or wood, and uh, you get a complaint from the uh, homeowner saying that the floors are dirty. You know, generally what they've done is they've gotten a towel or, or a cloth wet, went over to the floor and wiped it, and looked at it and there's all kinds of dirt on it. So, you know, I was thinking about this the other day and I thought, well, what do you think is the cause of that? Uh, what I came up with is that I'm thinking that we're not cleaning the floor well enough, meaning that because, uh, especially with wood floors, people don't want to over wet them. So we restrict the water, the amount of water that we put on them so we don't over wet them and cause damage. But one thing about a wood floor you have to remember is that we're not cleaning the wood, we're cleaning the finish on the wood. So uh, with that said, uh, if you think about, if we, if we don't, on our flat mops here, if we minimize the water that we're putting down on the floor to pick up the soil, that means that we're really not suspending that soil. So if we were to use a flat mop, a buckleless mop, let's say flat mop, to where we had a trigger on it and we can uh, add water, have a jet spray on it uh, to add more water to the pad so we can actually suspend the soil off the, the floor finish and be able to pick it up with the microfiber pad, I think we'll have a lot better results. So anyway, that's my question to you. Uh, do you. Do you agree with that theory or what's your thought on it? I sure would like to hear your thoughts. You know, go ahead and... Uh, uh, share your thoughts below and uh, let's have a discussion on it. Until next time, thanks. Talk to you later.